Looking for an alternate streaming solution? We're going to talk with Streambox next. It's Geekazine's coverage of NAB 2014, and it's brought to you by our friends over at Otherworld Computing, celebrating 25 years. Hey everybody, Jeffrey Powers here with Geekazine over at geekazine.com. We're here at NAB, and we're here with Alex at a company called Streambox. Now, if you use the regular streaming services, and you're going to yourself, yeah, I want something a little bit better, I want something a little bit more tuned to us so we can have a little bit more professional product, Check out Streambox. They got some cool stuff, including something for the glass, and we'll talk about that in a minute. But first of all, we've got Alex here. How are you doing, Alex? Pretty good, thank you. How are you? I'm doing. I'm doing great. Now, Streambox uh, is this a what? Where 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 is this located? Uh, we are located in Seattle, Washington. In Seattle, Washington. Okay. And uh, what are what do you guys do specifically? Well, we're very well known for backhaul video for TV broadcasters, but we also have video streaming service that we can use to broadcast video from your iPhones, from Android phones, from your desktop computer. And it's a very good alternative to you know, live stream or Ustream solution. So you have, you have basically have the software uh, and some hardware for that, correct? Correct. So you, well, you can go to Apple Store and just download any of our iPhone application or Android application and start broadcasting. Th those, are, those are free, right? It's free applications, yeah, absolutely free. And then after that, the video comes to our cloud service, which uh, eight servers around the globe, New York, London, uh, Singapore, Japan. <clears throat> and you can grab uh, embedded video code to put in your flash player or into iPhone's video streaming. Okay. And then and then do you have like uh, encoders that I can put onto websites and stuff like that? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. You could you could uh, you, you could also bring video back in baseband from from us to, you know, for high quality output. So uh, and for regular website uh, we provide a CDN that you could use and you just get embedded code and insert in your website. What, what, what type of costs are we talking about for that? It starts from $99, and of course there is free trial you could try. For, uh, like a 30-day free trial or yeah. something? Yeah, yeah, like that. So for $99, uh, if, if one person was watching your stream, how long would that take? I think it's about 200 hours. So basically, you can use a phone, you can use a laptop with a camera. It looks like you also have the, uh, these solutions right here. Right. This allows you to use more steady kind of type of camera with yeah. good lenses, light and uh, microphone. And that provides much higher quality of video. Yeah. yeah. And you can use any any uh, solution oh, like absolutely. this. Absolutely. Yeah, 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 absolutely. Yeah. Because yeah. I noticed you also have like black magic boxes oh, yeah. and, and stuff like yeah. that here. Yeah, so what we also do, we provide software only encoders. So say you have a HDMI camera and Mac, how okay. do you get in? So you use a uh, very uh, cost efficient black magic recorder, only $120. And we provide free, free software for Mac or for Windows. Okay. And uh, you know, you start broadcasting high quality using our software to the web. All right, there you go, and and, and you go from there. The app's free; yeah. can't go wrong on that. Ninety-nine dollars isn't too bad if you got, you know, uh, two hundred hours. Let's say that means if you're doing it one hour, we one hour, one hour show, you get two hundred people on there. You're good to go. Now, if let's say two hundred one people show up for that hour show, you're not going to cut them off. No, you're not going to cut them off. And also, as if you need to scale, we have much uh, you know better packages, and it's all available information on the website you can check out. Okay. Now you have larger broadcasting, uh, and that's where the Google Glass comes in, that's and we are going to talk about that next. Of course, if it wasn't for our sponsor, we would not be at NAB, and you wouldn't be catching some of this action. OWC, you know, they have some great memory for you. They got SSD drives for you. They've got a more enterprise solution in their Jupiter line. They've got a lot of great stuff. Memory that's made here in the United States, memory that you can put into your Apple, so you can put in your PC, you can put SSD. You could put an SSD into your Pentium 1 computer using the IDE tr uh, transfer cable. And they've got little adapters that'll do that for you. Lots of cool ways to make your computer have a longer life. Make your computer work a little bit more and save your PC, save your Mac. We have the hashtag, save my Mac. Tell me how you're putting memory from OWC into your MacBook. Maybe your 2007 MacBook, you just put on some Mavericks or something like that. Or maybe you just got the brand new Mac Pro and you want to add more memory but don't want to pay Apple prices. They've got solutions at a fraction of the price. You can check that out over at geekazine.com forward slash OWC. Geekazine.com forward slash OWC for some great ways. And then use that hashtag, save my Mac. To, uh, to tell me how you save money and memory 
on your Mac. All right, now we're back. We're, we're we were talking about the live stream from Streambox, all their, their solutions, but now we're going to talk about how we're going to incorporate Google Glass right. into your streaming solutions, and that has to do with this box right here, correct? Right. This, this box called Streambox Avenir Mini, and it's used by all... I'm sorry, Streambox what? Avenir Mini. Avenir Mini? Avenir is French for the future. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay, cool. So, uh, this box has built-in uh, LTE modems, or 3G modems, multiple 3G modems. So, that so I could do like a Verizon or an at and uh, Verizon, at and T-Mobile, okay. uh, yeah. My choice is that. Yeah, your choice, yeah. Okay, yeah. And then, say there is some event happens, you go with, the, uh, with this box, with your HDMI or SDI camera, you fire it up and you're on live, you know, you're on CNN or on Fox. Okay. So, and I'm always on Fox. <laughs> and usually what happens, the cameraman wants to operate this unit without taking their iPhone out. Yeah. And what we provide is actually control from glass to this unit. Okay. So we, uh, the unit has Wi-Fi spot that connects to glass automatically. Okay. And then uh, you can uh, say, okay, glass, start stream box seven year, and now I'm connected to the box. Okay. And then I could select some setting I want to stream it and once it starts streaming I could see actually am I on the air there is my uh, there is feedback back to the studio so it's not it's not showing you the picture it's yeah. it's giving you the details yeah. as to what your streaming exactly. box is doing how much betray I'm getting because it's very critical if you're getting only 500 kilobits picture is not so good so yeah. maybe you, you know you can, figure, you can figure out a problem right. adjust it switch exactly. out a switch out a, a Wi-Fi or something right. like that right exactly so, and in the future, uh, we're going to improve application, maybe some days live streaming will come through oh, yeah. this glass as well. And you'll be able to, to actually see, see what's the, coming on yeah, the camera. Yeah, so, yeah, But, yeah. you know, that, that's, that's a little bit out. Right. What are we talking about for price on this? Uh, it's uh, $15,000 device usually. $15, yeah, okay. yeah, so yeah, that's for TV it, broadcasters. Yeah, so it's, it's not for me, but it's for the well, professional yeah, broadcasters. Yeah, uh, and also, if you have time, I could show you a very small drone device. Oh, the, you have a little drone device. Exactly, what what yeah. type of price is that? Uh, it's we're looking about maybe depend four hundred to one thousand dollars depending on video interfaces used. Okay. And then that's also got the glass control. Uh, yeah, yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. It's well, that's pretty cool. Uh, but but this this is a little bit higher end for what my audience right. is looking for. But more more to the point, Streambox. You're looking for a, a way to stream without going through the regular uh, regular channels. Sure. Then you can uh, you can yeah. do that starting at ninety nine dollars. That's pretty cool. Correct. But also one mention is that some people renting boxes you don't have to buy. You could rent for oh, okay. for your event, you know, just a couple of hours and then it's Do you have distributors that rent Yeah, there, there is multiple companies we could point you to. Yeah. Okay. So you just go where where do people go for that information? Streambox.com website. Streambox.com. Correct. Okay. Well there you go. Thank you very much, Thank Alex, you. for your time. Free, yeah. All right, there you go. If you're looking for an alternative uh, in streaming and, uh, you know, the $99, very affordable price point on that over at Streambox. We got a lot more great video over at NAB. Jeffrey Powers with Geekazine. The YouTube channel is youtube.com forward slash geekazine. Don't forget that hashtag, geek out.